Hi, I'm Gerald Palumbo. I'm one of the owners of Seasons on the Hudson here in Irvington. And today I'm going to give you a few helpful tips on how to properly condition hydrangea. Um, we oftentimes hear people say that they, they purchase hydrangea from a florist and they, um, they will, they shrivel up, they don't last. But here are a couple of tricks that are going to make it very easy and you're going to see that hydrangea could be a very long lasting flower. First, I'm stop, starting with a clear vase of water. I've got floral preservative in here, a Floralite. It's very, very warm water. I tell people, you know, as warm as the water will come out of your faucet. You don't want it scalding hot, but you want it very warm. You take your hydrangeas, and I like to use clippers to do a split cut. You cut it on both angles and place it in the vase. Now, this is, any, any flower that has a woody stem, like hydrangea or flowering branches, always need to be split cut and always need to go into warm water. A general rule of thumb when it comes to you know, placing flowers in water and the temperature of the water, the harder the stem, the warmer the water. Flowers with soft stems like tulips or daffodils or sweet peas will go in cold water. Flowers with a little bit of a harder stem, like a lily, or um, uh, Bouvardi or something like that, more like a warm water. And um, then flowers with things like hydrangeas and then the flowering branches gets into very warm water. When you get into the just like real hard branches like dogwood or cherry, you can put them as hot water. Um, works really well. So I've just done this arrangement real quick with just about a half a dozen stems of hydrangea and there's also another trick sometimes when you have hydrangea and you've you've done this little thing or you cut them and you put them in warm water and after a couple of days you notice they're drooping another trick is to just recut get into hot water and then here's an extra trick that you can do which you just lay just a plain paper towel over top of them and then spray them with water now you're going to really soak and saturate the paper towel and then you take the entire arrangement and put it in the refrigerator for about four or five hours and you'll be really surprised that the hydrangeas will rehydrate they'll come back to life many times and when you take the paper towel off they'll be beautiful so that's our tip for today from seasons on the hudson and i would ask everyone to please check us out on our facebook page give us a nice like um, and we'll be back next week with another helpful tip from Seasons on the Hudson, 45 Main Street, Irvington, New York. Thank you.